When it comes to Deepin and crypto, there honestly is nothing better than the word free. And I mean that in the sense that it is free to get involved, free to participate, or you can get involved with the technology, the computers, or the phones you have maybe in your hand that you're currently watching this video on to earn a form of passive income. And I've talked about this before in a different video as far as different ways of earning passive income, but I want to talk about in today's video some of those ways that do include cell phone hybrids. And what I mean by that is ones that you can earn both on your cell phone and on the desktop. And Realistically, when you have both of those, most people have a computer or a desktop and most people do have a phone of some type. You are, if you're not participating, you're literally missing out on possibly a few hundred dollars per month, depending on how you approach this and how many devices that you have. So in today's video, we're gonna break down the top five projects that are completely free for you to participate in that only require a cell phone or a computer. In fact, most of these only require a cell phone, but you can dual, uh, dual method these. So that said, if you're new here, my name is Alex Nopa, Crypto, Crypto News, Crypto Passive Income. If you enjoy content like that, consider subscribing. You enjoyed this video, smash up the like. Without further ado, let's win the video. this list is a project called grass now if you're at all familiar with crypto and passive income especially with methods of getting involved without any cost grass is probably well known by you but if it is your first time hearing about grass well welcome there's a few things that i want to dive into now the first thing that you need to know about grass is it is completely free to run you can run it as a chrome extension they do offer more rewards if you download the node version onto your desktop but you can also run it on your mobile cell phone. In fact, you run it, you can run it on multiple different uh, cell phones. And in fact, my initial involvement with Grass was very, very early on. In fact, when you look at the uh, initial epoch, which is building the network, I was involved at the very beginning of this year. Sadly, I missed out on the closed alpha, but that was okay. I still earned from the airdrop that happened. Not as much as I probably could have, and um, I, I probably missed out on some opportunities putting this on more devices. But the great thing is that it is now in stage two. In fact, if you go back over to the reward, rewards, you can see stage two capturing the web. There is still more earnings to be had with Grass. So just because the airdrop itself is over doesn't mean the earning opportunities of Grass are over. So. If you have yet to participate, there's still ways to earn passive income from Grass that doesn't take any additional cost, hardware, or anything. That said, if it were me, I would run it on multiple different devices so you can capture as much passive income possibility as possible, if that makes sense. But um, there's a lot of things. Grass is an absolutely massive project. I think there, as you start to see more revenue streams, more partnerships that they have, you're probably going to see not only the token itself increase in value, but you're also going to see a lot of potential opportunities for additional revenue from grass. You can see here, stage two of the network is here. They posted this end of October. Focus is now capturing the web by building a user-owned map of the internet. Uh, more rewards, new product releases, such as live contacts retrieval, hardware, and rollout of the grass mobile app. So there's a lot of crazy things uh, that is going to be coming out and more passive income that is going to be involved. And the person that probably did this the best was my buddy Luke, um, who is a very much an avid cell phone miner. We're going to talk about Luke in just a second as well. So Luke, I'm pretty sure you're probably going to be watching this video, but huge shout out to you for some of the content and some of the ideas that you shared. But uh, Luke actually builds his own cell phone mining rig. So he designs these, builds these out, and he is absolutely huge. He has over 400 phones that are part of a cell phone mining farm. And so you can see here, a lot of these were running uh, on grass and he earned an absolutely astronomical portion of the airdrop. And as you can see, typically after airdrops, tokens don't really perform all too well. On the contrary, grass is actually doing quite well. Now the fully, dilu fully diluted valuation is a bit on the high side, 1.5 billion. 
in the market cap right now at 376 million and it has an insane level of volume so you can see the overall token price has increased about 90 percent since the airdrop so really good to see and i think there's going to be a lot more opportunities when it comes to grass down the road but realize if you haven't claimed your airdrop go and do so uh so that way you don't miss out on that so Moving on from grass, the number two, and this isn't any specific order, number two project that I would be keeping my eye on or getting involved in that is completely free is DNet. Now, I talked about DNet a few days ago, maybe about a week ago now on the channel talking about the passive income opportunity that is available because there's really nothing better than having multiple applications running on your cell phone that don't consume a lot of um, compute or other resources so you can really take your cell phone into a multi mining device so as you can see on my phone I've been running this obviously I have a few referrals uh, but I've been gaining a ton of traction on DNet and it is one of those things that it is an app there's not a lot of uh, resources that have to be downloaded the great thing is you can run it on iOS or on Android so that is the beauty behind this. And well, you know, at the same time I'm doing this, even though we're not gonna talk about Honeygain in this video, I am running Honeygain through my cell phone also. And we'll talk about at the very end of this video, another project that I'm mining with my cell phone. And the great thing is while the miner mining application takes the CPU, I don't have to use any CPU for DNet. Now, what is DNet? Now, I have a whole video talking about DNet. I will link it down below if you want to go and check it out. But essentially, DNet is a decentralized uh, decentralized storage more specifically, but you have two separate methods to this approach. You have the storage itself, and then you have the validation of the files that are being stored. So what, what you have in that is you have watcher nodes, and then you have the data keepers. Now, the watcher nodes themselves are the ones that verify the files. That is what makes it super unique. And the fact that anyone with a cell phone, iOS or Android is able to download it and run it for completely free and earn passive income. Now you have the other part, which is the data keeper, which is the storage side of the project. And that is currently sold out. So these are not currently available, but they will be coming available soon. Now, the one thing that you have to realize DNet currently is migrating over to peak and if you're familiar, we talked about Peak months ago, but Peak is going to be launching November, uh, I believe November 12th, and it is probably one of the largest and will probably be the most inclusive layer one blockchain for Deepin projects. So realize this is gonna be absolutely huge for DNet. It's gonna gain a ton of momentum and getting in now before there is a token generation event is gonna be in your best interest. Like I said, this is completely free, but this is more specific to only a cell phone. You can't currently run DNet on a computer. Um, I did talk to them about that when I talked to the team to get to know more about the project. That could be potential in the future as like a Google Chrome extension, but right now it is only available on the cell phone, completely free to download, completely free to use, and you have in the future the portion that is going to be on the computer which is actually providing the storage capacity and that's just going to be an additional revenue stream when it is available so overall i definitely would keep my eye on dnet i'd go follow them on twitter to make sure you are staying up to date with all the different things that are going to be happening and the exciting news that does come out there's over 40,000 connected devices right now as far as watcher nodes so it is really impressive to see the level of success the project is already having. Now, moving on from number two, number three is NodePay. Now, I've talked about NodePay for a while. In fact, I talked about NodePay after Grass because NodePay came out, I think maybe a couple of months after Grass did. And it was essentially the super early beginnings of NodePay. And NodePay is essentially the same approach that Grass has. And in fact, in a lot of ways, NodePay is almost at the same size as Grass. They've, they've gained a ton of partnerships, a ton of momentum, and it's interesting to see the level of success that they are currently having. Now, the only thing I can say about NodePay that's different is the unif user interface, and it's not really my favorite. I think Grass is a little bit sleeker, but 
you know, in the end, you know, as long as you earn your passive income, you earn your passive income, and I'm not really going to complain about it. Now, right now, as you can see, it is still kind of in the first season, and there's no essential, there's no specific airdrop announcement. There's not going to be any specific details yet that we've seen on the NodePay token. So realize that this is still relatively early um, as far as the project is concerned. Season one is still in play. And there are going to be some certain features that they are going to be looking at activating down the road where you can use points within the project itself. And as you can see uh, right now, you, what you have is over 500,000 nodes currently activated, which I think is absolutely insane. We've seen uh, grass at its peak, I think over 2 million. So you're seeing node pay grow faster and faster. It's one that if you don't have you can use it at the same time you use Grass. It is also just a Google Chrome extension, completely free to download and sets you up for potential airdrop or earnings, passive income opportunities down the road. Now, moving in to number four, and that is Acurist or Accurist, depending on how you pronounce it and depending on what part of the world you're from. But overall, Accurist is a very interesting one that I, I kind of do like to a certain degree I, it is kind of frustrating. I have it running on another cell phone of mine, if you can zoom in on that, a little bit of a glare. But uh, the one thing I don't like about Accurist is it takes over your whole cell phone. So I guess that's the only setback, but I, I know of several individuals that have tens of cell phones. I don't know if it's hundreds, but they have a ton of cell phones currently running on Accurist because of the early opportunity that it provides. In fact, they've moved into a second stage of the project that is going to progress it even further, which we're gonna talk about in just a second. This is one that you really only need a cell phone to participate in. And it's one of those that uh, almost any cell phone is compatible. I would just double check to make sure on the website. And I will have a future video on Accurist down the road, more of a dedicated video on the project. But it is just as simple as what you would see with DNet. But like I said, the only main difference is it pretty much becomes the new operating system of the Android instead of you being able to run other applications on it. That is really the only setback. Now, there is a lot of partnerships that Accurist has connected with. There's a ton of devices. You can see over 17,000 devices currently connected and a lot of projects that are partnering up with the likes of uh, what you see with Acris because of the cheaper compute and the what they call decentralized serverless cloud because of the compute capabilities and the cheaper compute capabilities of a cell phone rather than more powerful higher energy consu uh, consum consumers uh, consumption based hardware. So a lot of things that are exciting about Acris. Like I said, the cloud rebellion is currently what is going on right now. This is the most recent. Uh, kind of next stage of growth with this. So you have an onboarding of process, deploying of applications and being able to refer other individuals. So uh, like I said, I'm gonna have a full dedicated video on Accurist coming soon, but it is one that if you want to jump in there, the process is actually fairly simple. I'll link a video down below that if you wanna go and find someone who's already talked about it, feel free to do so. If you don't really wanna wait for my video, that is completely fine and I won't hold that against you. Now, that said, I wanna talk about the very last project, which is probably the one that I'm most excited about just because of the insane results that I have seen so far with Varus. Now, I talked about Varus. Hold on one second. I'm, I'm logging into my account here real quick so I can show you wh what Varus has done for me so far. And I think it's absolutely insane what has happened in just a very short period of time. And we're talking about the fact that with this, I didn't have a ton of cell phones. You know, I have uh, my buddy uh, Luke who has hundreds of cell phones, all mining Varus. He's making, you know, last I checked with him, he was making like 10K a month. Um, and that could be a little bit higher from really his cell phone form, which I think is absolutely insane to think about. But overall, I talked about Varus back in, uh, let's see, this was August of 2023. Yeah, August of 2023, so well over a year ago. And it's probably been one of my best performing videos talking about how to make $100 a month with a phone farm. Now, here's the thing is 
I have made in this, you can see right now in overall earnings, I've made about $30 uh, with really just about one cell phone. I moved my cell phones to other things, uh, but that is just with one cell phone that I've made in about a year. Now realize that number is about two to $3 a month, I guess, in total. So it'd take about 30 cell phones to be able to earn about $100 a month. And most of these cell phones we're talking about 40, 50 bucks that you can get relatively cheap. So when you look at the opportunity, there's not a ton of energy consumption, but what's been the craziest part about all this is the price increase of Verus coin. So since I did this video back in August, the price of Verus is up an insane amount. It's up over uh, 445%. We talked about, and this is just in the past year, so it's up even more because this is only going back to 61 cents. We talked about it at 40 cents. So Verus has done extremely well. This is a project that I think has a lot of unique aspects to it, but the beauty behind it is you can run it directly on your cell phone. So um, this is on an Android device. You can see that it is currently mining 4.72 mega hash. It's not gonna be anything that's gonna make life-changing wealth, but it is kind of cool to see the price appreciation that we've seen with Verus, the amount of growth that we've seen within the community. I think there's a lot of interesting things and more developments, applications that are coming to Verus that are being developed for this project. It is CPU based and that is where a lot of the appeal comes from. Now, Verus is one of those that doesn't take up your whole phone, but there are certain requirements, cell phone requirements that are required in order to run the application. So that said, it's not any random iPhone or random Android that can be run. There are specific requirements on the virtual CPU when it comes, or the, the CPU, uh, additionally, some of the memory, there's some specifics that are required for Veriscoin. I learned that kind of the hard way because I bought some alternative cell phones and come to find out they weren't able to be utilized. Luckily, I could return them. But in the end, do be mindful, the Samsung a o or the samsung a o 3 s is probably the one that almost everyone uses in fact i think i talk about that in this video uh and kind of go over yep samsung galaxy a o 3 s is the one that gains the most traction because it is one of the cheaper ones um and you can see this is kind of insane i actually talk about various coin price uh in this video i don't re even remember but you can see here this is kind of crazy. I, I didn't really think about this, but this is a hypothetical. If you have a hundred devices um, at $4,900, you would be making around $23 a day uh, at Verus coin price of $3.32. And Verus coin price is at $3.32. Kind of insane. I, I don't think I predicted this in any way, shape or form, but um, you know, that's, that's kind of wild. Either way, I think this is a great project. I think it's super interesting, a lot of potential with it. It's one of those that it doesn't consume a lot of energy. You can run from a cell phone. And the great thing is I'm running Verus, I'm running DNet, and I'm running other applications on the same cell phone and earning passive income. Multi-mining is the way to go in the future. So I'd love to hear your thoughts on these five projects. I'll leave links to them down below. If you wanna get involved, let me know which one is your favorite. If you enjoy this video, smash up a like. If you enjoy content like this, consider subscribing. And until next time, guys, stay invested.